little angels welcome back to another video if you're new here my name is antonia if you'd like to become part of our magical online family make sure you click the red subscribe button down below uh, because today we are sticking to the christmas theme that we've got going on with a couple of videos which is doing an unboxing of the primark stationery advent calendar and i will also be showing the hogwarts express advent calendar in more detail i did try and get the decorations on but unfortunately it wasn't in stock uh, i haven't seen it since supposedly it's come out in the liverpool pool um primark so i will keep an eye um, on <laughs> i will keep an eye out for it uh, obviously if i see it i will do a little video so you can obviously see all that primark have to offer and um, but yeah i will be doing this video showing what's inside these i did do a primark haul the other day so i will link that down below because these obviously are spoilers from it so if you want to obviously see that definitely check that video out but if you want to carry on watching to see what these have encounters like then feel free <laughs> Okay, so I'm not gonna lie, it's just took me a solid five minutes to get that train out of the packaging, uh, but it is absolutely gorgeous. So I have kept the little like wrapping thing on the door so the doors don't fly out. So we'll take it off, but I just thought while I'm holding it up, instead of like every single door falling out on us, which we don't want that, I thought I'll just keep it on for now. It does come in two little sets, it's got a little chain as you can see in the middle. Um, it's unconnectable, so you've got to keep it together. I think you could unscrew it. Um, but I don't know why you'd want to do that. But if you did, I think you can. Um, but this is what the front of it looks like. The Hogwarts Express. Um, oh my God, it's absolutely gorgeous. Absolutely stunning. Even like the size of the wheels they've done. Um, different. Don't, the back's got nothing going on, but I will just show you that. Anyway, obviously you will see. This is the little thing they've got to sort of protect the doors from falling out. We have all of them from 1 to 12 on this side. So, so some of them do have faces on them. Like we've got Harry as number 1. We've got Hermione as number 6. We've got Ron as number 8. Dumbledore as number 11. And then on the other side. Oh, they've got them the same. But like, what's being better if these are different characters? But I won't be like fussy. It was £15. Um... They've got like them again, the same for what's been different. Like, where's Hagrid and what they like that? Maybe like a little Neville or a Hedwig. I mean, they do the design for Hedwig or Draco, but it is still cute and it kind of matches. So, if you like it being kind of symmetrical, I was thinking of that word, which it is a little bit different because obviously, like Ron's then the first one instead of Harry, which Harry was before, blah blah blah. It is a 24 um, day calendar, well, door, draw thing calendar um but yeah it is gorgeous really goodly size oh someone's also trying to play with me because that thing's coming off get back in your oh this is not helping <laughs> push them back on that side push them out on the other um but that is it oh, sorry i know that's not really helping with the reflection because of that but it literally is keeping the doors together and i thought if i let these fall out <laughs> We're going to be here all day putting them back together. <laughs> but it is absolutely gorgeous. I really, really do like it. It's a really, really good size. Um, I will. I want to show you what the size of the drawers are. Right, let me pop it down because I don't trust myself holding it up. Um, so I will just take that off. And I will just take one of the drawers out so we can see. Oh, they're actually quite good sized. Do you think you could fit like a pin in unless you took it obviously off the backing card and things like that? So I was saying about ideas of what to put in them. Uh, but a little tiny chocolate. Like if you had like little magic stars, I feel like they'd be kind of cute in there. Or any type of chocolate that you like. I just love a magic star. Um, And that's it all around. So it is. They are really cute. Uh, obviously that's door number one. And then you just... It's in a great setting. We're just sliding that back in there, sorry. Um, but yeah, it is really good for £15. You can't go wrong. As I said, it is reusable. Um, so you can use it every year. It's a gorgeous Christmas decoration if you just want to have it as a decoration, even if you don't want to fill it. Um, it is absolutely gorgeous. So that is that. So if you do want that, obviously, you know, get it from Primark. I did go again, obviously, yesterday. They did have a few left in stock in the Liverpool Primark. They had, like, compared to the other day when I got it last week, they had a lot more um but some were still available because you've moved it now if you do obviously live in liverpool they've moved the primark the harry potter part they've moved the primark okay they've moved the harry potter part in primark downstairs on the bottom floor so all the christmas stuff is all there and they've also got the disney there as well because you have got a disney calendar and um, so if you're all wondering where it is it, it's there as soon as you go in on the right <laughs> it's over there <laughs> unless you change it by the time this goes up but that was only yesterday so hopefully It'll still be the same. 
so i am now going to move on to this candle so obviously if you don't want any spoilers then don't watch it any further i won't be offended as far as long as you like and subscribe it's okay don't worry <laughs> um but yeah this is the next one so this is a 25 day calendar so we have the extra day for every day all uh, 25 days of harry potter stationery so obviously it's going to have all things like that i think this would be amazing for any uh, witches or wizards that are still in school because you can't have too much stationery when you're in school or even if you're in college or university i've just finished my degree so i mean i'm, I'm gonna give quite a few of this to my cousin leah because she's still in high school um just because i don't really use it or even my other cousin megan who's still in university if obviously she wants it uh but the calendar itself is absolutely gorgeous um the only reason i'm going to give it away is just because i won't really get that much purpose from it obviously if it's anything i want to keep i'll keep but um i'd rather someone get use out of it than not but this is only 10 pounds um so obviously if you do want it it's absolutely beautiful i mean even if you just had that open like that in your living room i mean obviously i would to be honest i mean people spend ridiculous amounts on just decorations but just i mean the gold foiling doesn't really help with the lighting but it is and the silver foiling absolutely stunning um so we've got to play like a ways while you've found oh number one's right there okay so the number one has got the vegan claw emblem on oh we have oh god i've absolutely destroyed the door oh i've ruined the aren't i great <laughs> but yeah four little um paper clips if you can see them let me move that a little bit closer because you can actually see the h on that little paper clips and then you have blue two blue and two golds they're quite cute like i think they're really good when you have like assignments to give in or obviously like your homework you want to clip it all together absolutely perfect let me just take them out because i just feel like if i leave them in there it's going to cause me that right number two can you help me find number two where's number there's number two. Oh, he's tiny little door with the hogwarts crest on these doors once i think once you to be fair that one's not as bad that i've opened what are you oh this is a, okay i really like this this is dead cute this is a little green if you can see it and a little slytherin pride colors a little highlight set with the nine platform nine three quarters on it let me see if i can open it it's got a little that's really cute i used to love that when I was reading sort of needs to highlight it so you could see which bit with the key parts so great especially for like exam prep because normally all exams are in january which is great my birthday is in january so i love that um, but the next one we have is number three down here which has got a gorgeous little wand on so let's just open this little bad boy up oh we've got a little rubber with ravenclaw how adorable good little rubber oh bye bye rubber bye bye but that was cute then we have number four which is all the way over here we've got quite a few little doors at the minute to be honest because even number five i can see number five is on the other side that seems quite little i can open this door we are struggling oh my god hello get you open oh we've got the hufflepuff little rubber which is really cute they've done like a really nice print on this it doesn't really look like a bad oh no it does look like a bad chair it looks like a bit it's a bit like i've got a bit of a fox face i don't know if you can see that let me see if i can can you see the little foxy face cute though i'm gonna rub with it anyway it won't be there for long so we are on number five i am actually really liking this so far i like the fact it's like giving it a bit of, of everything oh, sorry i don't want to show you the back the back's got spoilers on as well if i haven't flashes Oh my god, I've got no nails. I normally have acrylics, so my nails are battered. So I've kind of trying to give them a break. Especially because my nail girl's grown as a baby. That was devastating. Well, I'm made up for it, but devastated that she left me. She's been fairly godmother, so that kind of traumatised me. However, she's come back next month. <laughs> so I can't wait for that. But then this will be probably more of a struggle without them. Oh, what are you? Can I get her out? Oh my i'll show you what it is before you see me like struggle for like the next 10 minutes i don't know what that is i don't know how i'm supposed to get it out either because i broke my nail then how traumatic i don't know how to get this out sweet let me see if i can flick it with one of these oh my the struggle is real got it got it got it got it oh Wait, why? What is it? 
Is it a magnet? It was stuck down. Look at that cheating activity going on there, is it? Oh, it's a little magnet. Oh, and it's got like little books on it. Reminds me of Hermione. It's very like... It's very Hermione. <laughs> and then like the Gryffindor colours. Well, red. Very cute. It was weird to struggle like, but that was a struggle and a half. Right, number six is back over here. Another little small door with the Hogwarts on. And I'll tell you what was on number five then. Number five had Slytherin on. How dare I, the cheek not telling you what it was. So, let's get this open. Oh, it's another one. Oh, oh. I don't know what they're supposed to be, but we've just got two lightning bolt people oh. <laughs> showing over there. Lightning bolt paper clips. They're cute, but I don't know what all they're from, but they've just flew at us. Oh, that was much easier to get off. This is another little magnet. This is adorable. Oh, this is gorgeous. I really like this one. It's got the little Hogwarts in a snow globe. They're really cute. For £10, you're doing well. Like, I'm glad it's not positioned. Like, I can imagine, obviously, there's going to be, like, pencils and that in, but I'm glad it's not, like, all about that. Oh, I say that. Seven's coming up. And Seven's a very skinny long one with a little heads wig saying, waiting well, an owl, but I'm assuming it's heads wig snowy, uh, waiting for my letter. Oh my god, this candle's going to, like, butcher me. There we go. Oh, we've got two, speaking pencils, we've got two pencils and what's the needy becoming. So we have, let me pop it down for two seconds. Just moving the train because the train was going to go flying. So we've got pure gold one. I love the ones with the rubbers on top. Like a two for one deal is the best thing in my life. And this other one is absolutely gorgeous. Like the advanced potion making. Does it say that on it? No. Just got books and cauldrons on it. That's lovely. Really big fan of them. They're absolutely lovely. And they're not too Harry potter -y. Like, you'd know the Harry Potter, but it's not like, apart from obviously like the cauldrons, but they're not like screaming at you, which is lovely. It's lovely when not and screaming at you. I'm just trying to find number eight. I've seen that. Where's eight? Eight? Am I blind? Can you see number eight? Two, 25, 19, 11. My thumb was over eight. Okay. Eight was there. <laughs> well, nine's next door, so we don't have to go far to get nine. But let's just open this one. I'm going to guess it's a pen. It looks like it'd be a pen. I'm struggling opening these doors. You know I struggle with packaging. <gasps> I was right, it's a pen. It was a size of a pen. This is really, really nice. This is actually a really nice calendar. Like, it's shocking me. Like, I didn't... I think I'd like it. I was really struggling to get things out. Like, I think I, I knew I'd, like, like it. Obviously, it's Harry Potter. But I didn't think I'd like it as much as I do because it's really subtle, which I thought it was going to be, like, bowls and in your face. But it's got the little... It's a grey pen with the Hogwarts there. Let me... I wonder what colour it's in. I'll just go on the back. It's blue. Blue ink. Um, but, yeah, it's a lovely pen. And that's it with... Oh. That's it with its little... Thing off. Sorry if that went funny then. It's sad to tell me that we only had 10% battery left. So, um, sorry about that. <laughs> but the next thing is number nine is next door. So, let's just get number nine open. I'm butchering this calendar. This is not going to look pretty at the end. Oh, we've got another little highlighter. So, it's like, it's a little platform nine and three quarters little set. A yellow version. Very nice. Then we have number 10. There's number 10. 10's a little tiny one. So this might be another rubber because we are still waiting for Slytherin and Gryffindor. Oh no, oh no, no. They were. Okay, so number 10 with the little lightning bolts. They decided to get over enthusiastic and run away. So that was number 10. Number 11. Ooh, all 11 for Christmas. Ooh, I like this one. Don't know what noise that was then. But. <laughs> Let's get number 11. What are you? These sticky notes. They've got sticking on the back. I think obviously this is to stop them from moving, even though some of them get a little bit over enthusiastic. Um, but it would have been awkward if you hadn't. Well, you would have got the ones in 10 before, and but. Oh, these are really nice. These are little sticky notes. The printing's not really the best. 
I mean the printing's a bit bad but especially on like the Ravenclaw, the Ravenclaw's supposedly on the top, Slytherin, the Gryffindor and then Hufflepuff, it's like the printing's got better as you get down, yeah, okay, well, the next one, it's still nice, I like sticky notes like that, if you just need to remind yourself of something, so number 12, up yeah, is the Gryffindor one, <sighs> me and Packager are never going to be friends, are we? Oh, here we go. Here's another rubber. Couldn't even think what that was then. Or eraser. Is the Slytherin one. Very nice. That one's a little bit battered. But it's very nice. When it's sort of stationary, you don't mind like, if it's a rubber. because Well, I don't. Just because, obviously, if you're going to use it. It depends, obviously, if you want it to still look pretty. Then it's going to bother you. But moving on to 13, we have Hufflepuff. which is um i've just ripped the whole calendar apart i've also got one of them oh well that's just ruined the back of that one these are lovely little sticky notes again so i will just show you them which is our oh, astronomy class first year students which has got the hogwarts background little let me just pop the calendar down so i can show you that little the, like sticky notes that go like that so they're all the same that's lovely, they're nice, good little size. You could write a little note on, but you've still got them. Very nice. Then 14 is the pretty Yule Ball one. So let's get that opened. A lot of it is, this video is me just looking down, isn't it? I do apologise. I just can't multitask very well. I'm just about to rip it. Oh, okay, you're not meant to be yet. That was a sneak peek to something else, but I don't know where that's supposed to be, but that's not supposed to be here. Uh, because we have, obviously, tape or gold foiling. That's really cute. You could use that as, like, washi tape, do they call it, when they do, like, scrapbooks. Really good for, like, creative projects. That's really nice. I don't know where that's supposed to be. I think that might be 16, so we'll find that soon, but at least we know where it is. But well, 15 is over here. 15 is rather large, so let's get 15. This is actually butchering on my nails. I've split one, but it's alright because they're only tiny. But let's just see if we can pop this door open. I'm just, I know it looks gorgeous and I'm gutted and I'm ripping it, but it's not the best to open. Oh, this is lovely. You screw off with your bloody stickies. Look at that. They're like half cement is in. You think we were building an house here? you get away with your stickies? I don't want to put them on my bed. It's like an hour and be able to get them off. Away with you. All stuff to my finger. There we go. Oh, these are adorable. The little gold stickers. So you've got Hogwarts. All the Hufflepuff houses on the bottom. Hufflepuff. All the Hogwarts houses on the bottom. Including Ravenclaw. Then I think we have Hufflepuff. <laughs> then Slytherin and then Gryffindor in the corner. And then we've got like the little broomsticks. The sorting hats. Stars. Books. A cauldron and two Fili Felix Felicis. That's really cute. I like that. I like that a lot. And then 16, I think, is the one we had the sneak peek of before. I don't know whether you would have seen it. I didn't actually say what it was, but I can imagine you would have seen a bit of it. This one has got a little bit over enthusiastic and decided to move down the calendar. Right, let me just lift. And it's a pure experiment trying to get these open. Oh, no, it isn't. Oh, I don't know what number that is then. This one's still on his right plate. Oh, maybe that's number 20. Oh, I don't know. We're getting sneak peeks for everything. This is this gorgeous little one pen. So it's of Harry's Wands. And it's a little one pen. Isn't that adorable? Because he actually sells these in... Oh, it feels quite heavy to write. And that is also in blue ink. I don't know why you'd be bothered what ink it is. But just in case. Because some places you can only write in certain ink colours. Like in exams, you can only write in black. But that is really cute. Really like that. That's really nice. Then 17, I'll pick it up so you can see it too. Where's 17 at? Look how butchered this, this is now. There's 17. 17 is a little one with the pretty golden snitch on. So I will just get this opened if I can. See that? There we go. Oh, what are you? What are you? We've got these little platform nine and three quarters. 
I like little... Am I missing something? I like little nails, but why would you need them? Would that be to like staple through a page? They're dangerous. Well, I say dangerous, but only because I'm a dope. But they're really nice. They're lovely. I'm going to pop them back in. That's so I don't lose a finger in the next couple of seconds. Um, then we have 18, which is the Huff Puff. Little badger. So we'll get him over here. Let's push him. Let's push 18 over him. It's easier to do from the inside than it is from the out. Just, oh, stop it. What's this? Is this like a little... Is this a little like wax seal thing or ink thing? I'm not very brainy, am I? No. <laughs> I feel like it'd be a little wax seal thing. It might be a, wa a full wax seal though. I'm trying to get the wrapping off so we can... Me again with this bloody wrapping. What I'll do is, because I'm struggling to get that off, is I'll have a little look, carry on, see if we get something that'll go with it. And it's... Oh, Ignore me, it might be a stamp. That'd make a lot more sense. That's really lovely. That'd be nice for like a teacher. I think to like just stamp your book with a little H. I'm gonna assume it's obviously for Hogwarts. So yeah, it's a stamp. What am I on about waxy? I mean, I do love waxy as well. I can't imagine me throw one in here. But yeah, that must be a little stamp. That's really nice. So we have 19, which has got another your ball. Um, Christmas bauble, couldn't think of that then. And we have more of this like washi tape, which is Hogwarts. And like this like grey kind of blue colour. Really nice, got like stars around. Lovely, big fan of that. And then we have number 20, so we've not got far off. 20 is, I think, the one that is the escapee, uh, which is the Slytherin. So let me just pop that open, just... Get it open. Oh. Yeah, this is the escapee, so I'm just gonna pull him out. I've absolutely butchered this calendar. I butchered, butchered. Just slide off for me. There we go. Which is a lovely ruler of the Hogwarts Express. I feel like it's really nice quality, all the stuff they've got in. Like, it's not cheap. It doesn't look cheap. It looks really nice. So we've got the Hogwarts crest at the bottom and then the platform nine and three quarters. Um, obviously it's all in red, really nice. A bit better if you like a Gryffindor. Sorry, I've got something in my eye. Needs to itch that eye then. <laughs> um, but yeah, no, that's really nice. And then 21 is up here. So let's open the 21. 21's got the like little one lit up. Oh, here we go. Now we've got the, the shovel like sort of had a bit of a bad time. We have the Gryffindor runway um in there which is really cute so you've got the full crest houses together in your rubber set and then we have number 22 there we go which is the hogwarts this christmas i'd rather stay at hogwarts this christmas Have a little snitch as well and we have what is that what is that What's that? Is it meant to? Oh, is it meant to come across? What's that? Does anyone know what that is? That's not really. I'll just flip it that way. Am I? What's that? I'd say if it's supposed to be the Hogwarts Castle, but. I can't imagine it is. Is it just a big paper clip? I don't see how it's Harry Potter themed. Unless I'm really missing something, please tell me if I am. But I don't have a clue what that is. But that was number 22 anyway. That's the only thing I don't really get. Um, but it's still going well. For 23, we have a little snitch. In a little small door over here. We've done quite well, fans. And it was only eight that we really struggled with. Which is, oh, we've got a sharpener, which will be good for our pencils, which is a black Hogwarts sharpener with gold on. Really nice. I like the ones that catch all your rubbish, but 
and obviously just go over to the bin and do that so that's not a problem um, and then 24 has got Gryffindor on so let's just see what that is number 24 let's get you open 124. Oh, this is cute. I might actually need to start using this. Oh, it's gone then. Horrible. Oh, I'm just going to leave the last page in there because it's stuck to the thing. I don't know why I did put it on paper. Which is a little to do list. Absolutely adorable with a little snitch and a couple of stars on the bottom. And it's got like quite a few little pages. That's really, really nice. And obviously, it's the same on each page i really like that because yeah, i need to get a lot more organized obviously i really like it when i have like a, a video idea just to write it down straight away so you don't obviously forget about it and then the final thing is number 25 which is uh, look at how much i've butchered this calendar um but it's a massive reading claw door here so let's get you open and see what it is Oh, it's a little notepad. Oh, this is really nice. I'm being an actual real big fan of this advent calendar. So it's like a... It's got them sticker thing on the back. Let me just get the little nasty little thing off on the back. There we go. It's like a purpley kind of colour. Obviously, it's got foiling. And then... What? There you go. It's got this little pattern on the inside. Um, looks kind of magical. Oh, and then on the other side, they have a Hogwarts emblem on the other side. So that's really cute. Good little pocket size. So that'd be good to like write the videos down in. Um, but yeah, that is lovely. So if you want to see, I've absolutely battered the calendar. Um, but I actually think that was really worth 20, uh, 20 pounds. I think that was looking at 22. I think that was really worth 10 pounds. This is the back of it. Does it tell you what everything is? Oh. Oh. Hold it that way. It's a sort of hat. That's what that is. That makes a lot more more sense. It's No, I prefer it that way. It's a sort of hat. So you just slide it on over obviously your paper if i've got any paper i can slide it over so you can have a little look wait i don't feel like that i will just slide them on because you can't see them okay maybe don't slide them on because if you slide them on it's gonna have a face so maybe it's just meant to look pretty in your bag um, but that's a spoiler on the back that's all i could see what it was so that's everything there for you um, but yeah i'm a big fan of this calendar for 10 pounds got the little price on the bottom um, but yeah from primark definitely think it was worth it i'm a really big fan i actually really liked a lot of the stuff in there um, so i'm a massive fan i think it was absolutely gorgeous so let me know in the comments down below what your favorite advent calendar was either was it the train or the stationery set i think me train is still my favorite just because it counts as a decoration i can use it every year however this stationery really shocked me i didn't think i was going to like it as much because it didn't look on the back because i thought i didn't want to spoil it for myself but i actually loved it i'm a real big fan and i actually really liked it so yeah let me know in the comments down below which one was your favorite what was your favorite stationary item mine was um, hard choice i really liked the little magnets i thought the stickers were really cute i like the little notebook i think the notebook's really gorgeous perfect little pocket size so maybe the notebook but then i also loved the pens so i don't know i was a big fan of it all like the highlighters the rubbers the little sticky tape basically everything i liked everything apart from well i do now like the sorting hat because i know what it is but i think it's a bit functionless because at least with these it's like if you put it on you're still going to be able to see what it was but whatever it's still cool um but yeah big fan of that and i also don't really know what they're for either <laughs> Am I okay? <laughs> it's the little, oh yeah, it's got stuck in it and everything. The platform now and three quarters are showing me on the back what they're for. Because it's just showing me them. Let me see them. And I just showed you them on the back and card, so I don't really know what they're for. But yeah, it was great. So I hope you liked it. Definitely like this video. Comment down below what your favourite was. Check out the Primark haul if you haven't already. I also have a giveaway going on at the minute um, to win two advent calendars. The Funko Pop one 
in the Your Ball Limited Edition and the Lego Harry Potter Advent Calendar. So if you do want to get your hands on them, definitely enter the giveaway. I will also link that down below. That doesn't run out until the 20th of November. Um, but yeah, that's everything. So I do hope you really enjoyed the video. I hope you have a lovely day, evening, whatever you, wherever you are. <laughs> um, but yeah, hopefully I'll see you in the next video. Bye. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm.